Hi, I'm Saif Ali Khan, the voice of Star-Lord in Marvel's Wastelanders, and this is my audible mic check. So we find Star-Lord 30 years after all the world's supervillains seized control. Uske Guardians of the Galaxy ke jalwe wale din ab guzar chuk hain. Wo ghayal hai, kamzor hai, and the world isn't what it used to be either. But when duty calls, Star-Lord answers. He goes on a mission to find the Black Vortex, which is an ancient relic that is known to yield cosmic powers. To kis se milega Black Vortex? Kya hogi usse pani ki kimat? Ye janne ke liye aapko show suna padega. Well, I mean, it's just a really interesting uh, thing to do. It's, it's as, as an actor also, it's just such a iconic and beloved character. So that was exciting just to be part of this uh, amazing universe of Marvel and it's such a good script. And the concept of doing something based on just voice is also something that's very interesting to me. I wanted to do something. I think um, audio books, audio as a medium is very powerful because it deals so much with the imagination. And it's a nice acting job. Uh, so this is a story of survival and redemption which resonates a lot with me. I mean, the power of listening to a story like this as it unfolds in your imagination as you listen and you feel like you're fighting to save the future of the Earth. So it has impressive sound design. I think internationally some amazing performances, so nice to be part of it. I think there, there are some kind of similarities perhaps. He's a family man and he's also overcoming you know, many challenges and hurdles like we all do in life. I think everyone can relate a little bit to Star-Lord, that's the point. Well, imagination is its own kind of cinema. You as the audience listening, you know, control how a character looks in your mind, how the world around them looks, how a scene looks and how it feels and unfolds. And it's also kind of limitless in terms of imagination and budget. Like you just say something and then people imagine it. You describe the universe or a galaxy or, you know, spaceships that look like castles and, and whatever. So, you know, the smallest, you can be as descriptive as you want and, and the mind is, so it's kind of infinite in scope. So it's amazing. Well, I mean, it's an inspiring story about human resilience, no matter what hardship you face in life, there's hope on the other side, but you have to fight for it. I think uh, it's very good casting. I'm, I, I'm not at all surprised. Um, I think she won't have to change her voice much. You know, she'll be able to easily uh, match the tone of the character. There's something attractive and, and sexy as well as kind of mysterious and cool about the character. Thor is one of my most favorite characters. And uh, the kids like Iron Man, the Fantastic Four, Silver Surfer, uh, just to name a few. Doctor Doom was my favorite villain. I used to love reading about the origins of these people and how they started off as good people and then something horrible happened. Really lovely stories. So really wonderful, especially sharing the space with um, Rajesh Hilji as Rocket, uh, because he's just an incredible actor and his voice is amazing. I think he's one of the best people in the world when it comes to dubbing and nobody could have done a Mumbai Rocket better than him, I think. Sunye Mujhe as Star-Lord, Sirf Marvel's Wastelanders in Hindi, only on Audible. Download the app now.